Hi guys, I've uh, installed the latest ISO for the release of September, right? At this point in time, since yesterday, there's a problem with the GRUB package. So let's see how it affects it. How, let's see how we can change it or, um, well, be smart about it basically and see if there are workarounds. So this is the ISO. I did an easy installation, which means Yep, we get all the updates in. And one of the problems, well, the problem is GRUB. So this version R322, that breaks the system. So there are two options, like I've written on the Articlonix uh, forum. Option one, you do a clean install. This is a clean install. You update your system, all good, all in one go. Just update everything and then downgrade later on. Don't forget, downgrade GRUB. And then an update GRUB, just to be sure that it uses the correct files or correct uh, text and all that. And then we can safely reboot. So this is also a video about how to downgrade things. Basically, everything is on the internet. This has not any browser, this system here. So I need to install myself a browser but arclinux.com downgrade, arclinux D maybe downgrade. If you, it's if it's too far ahead and, and no, only the UFI systems are affected. So I've uh, set to the system here, have a UFI system. How do we see that? Duff, right? We have boot EFI here. That's why we know, ah, I'm affected. Otherwise you wouldn't have this line there. So before I update, I shouldn't update right now. Everything breaks if I do. So before I do sudo downgrade grub. Now choose. And the one that I know that works is this one or this one. So it doesn't really matter which one, but go back in time, not 322. Okay. Then the system says, as usual, you want to install. Yes, yeah, sure. And this is an important thing. Add grub to ignore packages. So in the future, when I type update, ignore the package grub. Okay. So I'm not sure if this is necessary or not, but I update grub, have these lines, check everything that everything looks normal. It, it does. So sudo reboot, and we should be able to reboot virtual box or not real metal, doesn't matter. UFI, right, should be there again. We can break the system and test it if it works. It's a first machine anyway. Control T. If we do update, I know if, um, let's see. No, it does not. But I can do it like this. Minus S grub. Grub is an ignore packages install anyway. Yes, basically I know I'm gonna make it crash, but let's have a look, right? Is it crashing now? Now the, the the thing is, I'm going to do first the sudo reboot so I can learn myself. Is it after the update grub or is it? Yeah, it's after the update grub and the update grub thing is something that we do automatically in scripts. Update grub. If you do this now, this looks all benign, all good, all fine. And then you reboot. And we get this. So the update that we get in, if we want to change our grub and we type the normal code for update grub, right? So though, whatever it was again, look at the alias, alias update grub, something breaks and we end up in this. This is the um, firmware. This is the, uh, the settings of your motherboard. In my case, it's a virtual box in the other machine that I have on my left. It ends into this and no way to get back to the system unless you learn how to shroot. So shrooting control all G probably is best. If we go for Arco Linux and then shroot or arch shroot, let's see what we get. 
Use the power of arch root when your computer crashes. Basically, that's, that's, that's it, right? You have a grub. That is not correct. You need to downgrade the package grub and type again update grub. And all the information is here available. And there is also one on the Arconex forum. Arconex forum. And all of us, we're all affected. Let's see if we have active topics. Voila. Info. All right. Info. Grub update break system reported today to me. But yesterday the grub package came in and then people update or this morning or reboot. I mean this morning. Et voila. You got sell yourself an unresponsive system. And these are all explanations. You can find them on Xero Linux, on Garuda Linux. So we're all affected with, by this uh, update. And the best thing is just don't update grub package or immediately downgrade the package. That's also good. Now this is arcolinuxd.com. We have also Arcolinux com arcolinux.com so two websites and here as well i believe i've written an article about shroot because it's that important you can fix any computer system with well not any any arch linux computer system with this the power of shroot arch shroot is important i will explain to you with um, this option, right, because we're on virtual box, we need to go to right control F2, F4, 5, F6, and make it work again. But that's the next video. All right, cheers.